Busquets. He'll sit two young players, Ruiz Kromaski with a ton of legs, supporting Farias and Martinez up front. With three matches left in the season, Pat Noonan's been rotating, makes eight changes from a team that lost 2-1 to one to New York on Wednesday. Eight goals from Inter-Miami sent it to extra time eventually, one in penalties. Underway, Inter-Miami and FC Cincinnati in a must-win match for the home team. Said, will it be Joseph Martinez on the end? To the back post, Miller arrived, it's there, off the bar! It was Aviles, wonderful opportunity, nine minutes in to put Miami up. Now here comes Cincinnati. Acosta Vasquez, this is beautiful. Arias Santos and wide. Well, set pieces, just a great little understanding there from Kamal Miller, knowing he can't redirect that on goal, played across the goal. Fortunate it doesn't hit the underside of the bar and go in, but how about the counter transition from Cincinnati the other way? Acosta just lets him go. Ruiz couldn't settle it. Direct on the counter from Cincinnati. Vasquez does really well to bring it down. Has Santos in the middle. Santos might be in! Big save, Drake Callender! He's in a good spot, but how about this ball? And how's this for a first touch from Brandon Vasquez? But then to have the ability to play the right ball to Santos. Rain starts to fall at Drive Pink Stadium. Noah Allen cuts it back to Benjamin Kramaski. Now David Ruiz. The three into Miami homegrown into the feet of Joseph Martinez. Hits it with his left off the post. Second time tonight into Miami has hit the woodwork. Fitness wise, and you're not operating at top speed the way Joseph Martinez has since the knee injuries with Atlanta United. You've got to be uber aggressive and just fight. Martinez, Kramaski back to Joseph Martinez. Oh, what a ball! Kramaski's in! A third time off the post! The crossbar from Kramaski! Quality chances. How good is this from Joseph Martinez? Everybody in this stadium felt like he was going to bend it back post, but to cut it against the grain of Matt Miazga to give Kramaski... But Katie's report is spot on. The yep. distance between Vasquez and Miazga, it's unacceptable. Here's a pocket for Joseph Martinez to come into. Tries to get around Miazga. Now Farias. Farias saved by Celentano. Smarter, simple. Oh, Yedlin, nifty around Barial. Still DeAndre Yedlin, not clear. Celentano will punch away, still not clear. Martinez, he's done that before, doesn't get it right this time. Wobodo wins it. This could be a chance for Cincinnati. Acosta, Arias is forward. Arias, awkward from Callender. Oh, then the big save. Acosta trying to get back on it and dealt with by Miami. Saves from Drake Callender. Cincinnati doing a much better job with their shape and then on the counter finding the right pass. That one's difficult. To... In the many. first half, you saw four or five players get out on the break. Farias is slow. Kramaski slow. Ruiz is a little slow. Acosta. It's up. Bupenza. Deflection. Oh, my word. Off the post, inches away from an own goal. Instead, just a corner. And in sync, Cincinnati can catch Miami on the counter. Oh, Messi slipping under pressure from Acosta. Martinez, Sean Mota has a go and just wide. If I'm Pat Noonan, Dominic Kinnear, and my staff, I would love to see Vasquez one on one with Kristoff in open space. What can they do to make that happen? Keep possession, get Bupenza underneath. Bupenza's going to have a go. Oh, Bupenza struck it well and wide. Oh, no, well with Pupenza coming into this second half because he's dropping into that. And so if Kamal Miller leaves the momentary hero for Cincinnati before Miami won in penalties, knocked down, cleared by Yedlin, right back to Barrio, will get another chance. Good ball in, off the post again! Fifth time tonight, it has hit the woodwork all on this south end at Drive Pink Stadium. And three off the same post. 
three identical opportunities where they've deflected off the inside of the post and come out. Whether Kubo back to Barial, another chance. Over everybody, might work out. Bupenza tried to nutmeg Allen. Acosta to Bupenza. Still Bupenza, oh, still Aaron Bupenza! Calendar makes himself big. So they know what a Cincinnati goal would mean. But you see what I mean about Bupenza, where he, something out of nothing he can do. Yep. Game can be ugly, it can be chippy, he's got pace. He's got a real propensity to put defenders in a bad spot, Calendar doing everything he can coming off his line. Like Kramaski was gonna get on it. Now it's Barial trying to take a touch and have a go and he's not able to and Stefanelli puts in the defensive work for Inter Miami. It's just too much though from Bupenza. Good work here to recover and Wins steal it, it off back. the Busquets. It's Kubo! Calendar pushes it! Barrio! Cincinnati breaks through and maybe ends Inter Miami's playoff hopes. Alvaro Barrio of a moment. This was a better move from Pat Noonan in FC Cincinnati in the second half. Get Kubo into the game. Great range, great ability to impact the game from the defense to the attack. And Bariel, one of the best moves of the MLS regular season from FC Cincinnati coaching staff to take a winger and make him a wingback. He's a 2023 MLS All-Star. Arias. Going around Kristoff, cutting it back. Bupenza wasn't there. And it's over. The Supporters' Shield winners and Inter Miami's playoff hopes.